be lived out in our body. We are taking this juice because we want His blood to be coursing through our veins, and we want to be serving like He served. It's an outgrowth of the first experience of washing one another's feet. And so as we participate in this, and He says we all ought to do that. In 1 Corinthians, it tells us that everyone is supposed to do this. If we're going to be Christians, we all need to be partaking. And then there's sometimes people say, well, I don't want to take it unworthily. Well, if you came with a heart full of malice, and you're bitter toward your fellow man, and you and and, and you don't want to get things right, then you probably shouldn't partake. But if you desire to follow Christ, and you desire His Spirit to be yours, and you desire to forgive humanity, and you desire to be a servant, then you probably should participate. In fact, it would be a, a bad thing for you not to participate. And so, and... Um, I've noticed through the years there does seem to be a direct correlation between those who come to communion and the spirituality of the church. So I praise God. Today is what's good. We've announced that we were having communion today and you still came. But it's about service, isn't it? It is about service. And when we have the Spirit of God working in our lives and in our hearts, we will better reflect His image and more will be a different place, amen? So by His grace, as we, as we go out today, we will go out with a renewed zeal to serve humanity. Now, for those of you, I know there are a number of people here today that have not partaken of a communion service with us before, so you're not really sure what this looks like. And first of all, you are welcome to participate if you've accepted Christ as your Savior. We practice open communion. All are welcome to participate. We'll have a foot washing service first, and the way that works is we will be excused from this room, go to separate rooms. We have uh, three rooms set up for three different purposes. One is to take care of our little.